Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Eno. In today's video, we'll be looking at how we can open or how we can run .exe files on Ubuntu Linux. I'm on the terminal here on my Ubuntu machine and I have a file here called party.exe. Now this kind of files are native to Windows, but it's possible for us to open them on uh, Ubuntu Linux. Now we'll need a tool called Wine in order for us to open the file or to run the file. So we'll need to install the tool, but first let me do an update of the packages. So I'll run the command sudo apt update, and then I'll press enter here, put in my password. Uh, let me clear and let me do a list again. Now, if I try to open the file or to run it, if I let's say, for example, if I did putty.exe or if I just tried putty, I get an error. So we need wine to run the file. Now, let me install the file. The command is sudo apt install wine. That's why for yes. Okay, the installation is done. I can clear this. And if we say, for instance, which wine, you can see that we actually have the tool in that directory. The other tool we need is a libwine, which we can install using sudo apt install libwine. Press enter here. And it's already installed. Now that we have wine installed, let's go ahead and try to open that file or that application, this one right here. Now putty is a tool that we can use to do remote connections. Now, to open it, we'll do wine and then we'll put in the file name here. So, this pop up window says that wine is being updated to please wait. Okay, and it's done and party is open. Now, like I said, this is a tool that we can use to do remote connections. I have another machine, it's a Linux Mint machine. And let me just minimize this. And let's see if we can actually remote into that machine. The IP is 172.16.1.103. I'm going to use SSH for 22 here. So I'll click open. I'll click accept. And I'm being prompted to log in. The username is Eno. Put in the password here. Try to pass it again. And I'm able to log in. I can do who. And you can see it's Eno. And I'm coming from this IP, which is uh, the IP for Ubuntu, the 172.16.1.104. If I was to open the terminal here, let's open a new window. Ready IP address. You can see that that's the IP here. So that's all for this video. That's how you can open the exe files using Wine on Ubuntu Linux. So I hope this information has been helpful. I'll catch you in my next video. Thanks. Bye.